Yo, what is going on today, boils and ghouls? Welcome back to the third installment to House of Ashes. This is your boy Bebop Gaming, and if you didn't see the previous episodes, I highly recommend you just backtrack a bit. You don't want to miss any of this insane series that we're doing. This is probably by far Dark Anthology's most craziest game. And we're only on episode 2 going on to episode 3. So you guys, I'm not going to leave the intro too long. But we fell into hell. There, there's no other explanation. I don't know what these creatures are. And I don't know what else is down here. So without further ado, we're just going to hop into it. We're going to see how this all plays out. Eric, take a look at this. You think it still works? Let's find out, shall we? The tape is all tangled up. It's fine, I can fix that. So when did you stop wearing your wedding ring? When did you stop wearing yours? It didn't. Always close to my heart. You were always a good guy. Maybe too good for me. I haven't forgotten what this ring means to me. I want you back, Rachel. You need to let go of it. Someone else now. I knew it. The bones of this temple are drenched in blood. We have set foot on an uncharted shore and roused something ancient and wicked. A blasphemy that comes in indescribable shapes and forms. For eons we lived as children in this world. Unaware of the horrors that slumber beneath our feet. Now we have blindly thrown open the gates to madness. I fear being taken. But I must do what I must. We must seal this place for eternity. For all mankind. Mary. I'm sorry. not supposed to play out like this. Any call signs? This is King. Contact, contact. Taking fire. Did anyone call me over? That's right, Joe. King, this is Mailman 21 Actual. Say again. Over. King, this is Mailman 21 Actual. How copy? Over. Damn it. Uh, let me go. Leave me here. Stun us down. We need to get to Rachel. I can't leave me! I'll hold him off. Marlin, those are not Iraqi! Whatever the fuck they are, they're mine. Go.
I'm not leaving a man behind. No fucking man. Then you die with me. Goddamn place. You're not serious. That looks decades old. That's all we have. Can you see him? Yeah, he's coming. Who? <sighs> oh. Shit. No! Oh god. I hope I made the right call telling Eric. Telling him that uh Rachel's seen someone else. Rachel. Oh my god. No! Catch dude! Catch her! I got you. And I'm not gonna leave that guy behind. There's no way I'm gonna leave him. Do something. My boy isn't going to be able to hold so on sorry. forever. So sorry. No, no, we're no, I can't. I, I can't. I can't. I can't do it. Come on, boys, hurry up. Give us... Oh, my God. Come on, please, please, please. Fuck! I can't... I can't cut the rope. Oh, my God, it might... I, I don't know. Come on, buddy, you took a slug in the shoulder. No, please, please, stay up, stay up, stay up. No, no, fuck. nightmare have these luckless souls fallen into? One life cut short, another lost to the darkness. Seems things have taken a turn for the worse, wouldn't you say? It wasn't a bad way for Eric to bow out. At least he died a soldier's death. What of Jason and Nick? Brothers in arms, but are they really as close as they appear? Or will it be a case of each man for himself? Which brings us to Salim. He seems level-headed. An almost reluctant soldier, perhaps. An unwelcome fate now awaits our survivors, trapped beneath the earth, swallowed by the void. It's inevitable that some lights flicker and die. 
How long the remaining flames burn for is up to you. It's not my place to concern myself with the affairs of others, but it does keep things interesting. I can offer you some words of advice, as long as you are willing to keep this strictly between ourselves. A prudent choice, all things considered. Long ago, I met a blind poet who impressed upon me these wise words. Long is the way and hard, and out of hell leads up to light. That's all for now. I can't believe I lost one. Rachel's not dead, but I lost Eric. I haven't lost any, like, of the main crew since until dawn. Fuck. Should've left me. I killed them all. I'm not leaving a man behind. No one's we getting left behind. For right now, we stay tight. Honest. His cards were marked the moment we stepped off that helo. You think Rachel was with him? I don't know, buddy. There's nothing we can do here. First things first, we gotta find somewhere to dig in. They're coming for us. They're coming. <laughs> Over there. Let's go! Mailman to one actual to all call signs. How copy over? Joey, report in over. Joey's dead. The fuck you talking about? The Iraqis tore right through him. He died in my fucking arms. Oh no, not Joey. The hell are we gonna get out of this? We gotta lock this place down. Form a defense perimeter and buy ourselves some goddamn breathing space. These statues. Nick, take a mental picture and snap the fuck out of it. What is this place? It's not the silos, that's for sure. This mission's a bust. We should have never gotten off that helo. Whatever's down here, it's worse than anything we've ever faced before. That I believe. Do you think we're being punished? For our sins? Now stop being such a pussy. Yeah, some bad shit is going down, but you and I, we're better. We're Marines. Screw these freaks. For all we know, they could be some of Saddam's fucked up experiments. And if not, and if this voodoo shit runs deeper, then we'll find a way to bury it. Let's find the others. We can't be the only ones here. We'll find the others. Then we'll get our payback. Oorah. Let's go check it out. Leave Marwin here. Are you serious? We need to lock this place down tight. We have to check it.
So this is Saddam's chemical weapon silo, huh? Run for the fucking hills. We're all doomed. So much for Eric's pioneering thermal satellite system. Eric's paid a pretty steep price for that failure. We all have. There's the generator. Let's go take a look. Need a hand here. I'm on it. Someone's taking a serious dislike to this thing. Sabotage. Looks it. Watch my back. Ow. Shit. Stop fucking around. Hurry up. Does it look like I'm fucking around? Good job, Sergeant. I don't play these games. Nope. Nope. Look alive. Copy that. Cable split. Let's see what they lead to. This way. Fuck. Watch your step. There's a tripwire. Clear. It looks simple enough. Counter explosion? Nah. Just need to cut the trigger. Now that's not very nice. It's gotta be the Iraqis. Yeah, you think? And there I thought it was the monsters planting bombs. October the 21st, 1946. Crow was the first to break into the tomb, an honor he shared with Bessie, that damned machine gun of his. It was a beast of a weapon, but it seemed to comfort the fellaheen doing the digging. This place has lain undisturbed for centuries. It is not the tomb of Alexander the Great, but a temple of an even older god king, the Akkadian despot, Naram Sin. Been mistaken, but Lady Bradshaw still declares it a find for the ages, a discovery that will write our names in the annals of history. Looking out at this sceptered hall, I have no reason to doubt her. Could be waiting for us down there. Shh. Listen. Is that Joey? He's alive. It's not possible. You heard him just now. It can't be. That is definitely him. It's this fucking place, Jason. I'm telling you, I saw him die. All due respect, buddy. You're not your usual self. Can't know for sure. 
It's a trap. We don't know that. We don't leave men behind. Semper Fi. Semper Fi. Okay. You should have known better, Selim. I almost just lost another one. Oh no, tell me that's not gonna move. Oh no, bro. That's not okay. Hey, what's this? Dar? Either it's Salim's wallet or it's his commanding officer. I don't want to go near that body. I don't want to go near that body under the truck. Is there any other way I can go? Oh, man. You can hop that. Come on. Okay, look at this. I can walk up the side of this and jump onto the rock. Oh, I don't want to do this. Why would anyone do this? Okay, you're taking a bit too much off of that. I was about to say, you better make that jump. Bro, get to somewhere, get to somewhere, get to somewhere. The light, it burned it.
Okay, I want to just take a second while we're walking through here. I feel like I have a really good idea on what these things are. But... So the light burned it. Crushing it with a truck didn't help. Bullets don't do anything but stabbing it in the chest. Well, what I'm thinking is the heart did it in. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say what I think it is. I might jinx it. So. Leave a comment down below if you think you know what I'm thinking. Still here, Joey? This is Mailman 21 Actual. Joey, do you hear me? How copy? Over. He's in bad shape. We gotta move fast. Check your weapons. Don't leave anything to chance. This fucking place. How deep is that damn hole? This is fresh. That's solid fucking rock. You think these things got through it? Stick around and find out. He's hit bad. Not much we can be sure of. Something really fucking nasty went down here. Hurry the fuck up! Seventh of December, nineteen forty six. Our finds have been so spectacular. I couldn't resist breaking out the champagne. As I entered the survey tent to pour a glass for Mary, I realized something was awry. She'd found Bradshaw's crate of dynamite. I tried to calm her, but she worked up a full head of steam, sounding off about the risks of using explosives at a dig site. She was right, of course. I feel terrible for hiding it from her. Just then, Crow arrived and picked up the dynamite. When Mary ordered him to put it down, he looked her boldly in the eye and said they'd found something below. What the hell did they find down there?
We know what we're facing now. Eyes wide. Stay frosty. You may not be alone. Mailman 3 to Mailman 2, 1 actual. Come in, Lieutenant, over. This is Mailman 3 to Mailman 2, 1 actual. Come in, Lieutenant, over. Oh, no. Fuck, we got split up. I am not looking forward to this. I'm going at this cautiously. I'm not losing any more people. I still don't even know what happened to Rachel after she fell. This is insane, dude. The whole atmosphere of this, the 3D audio. Oh my God, dude.
Holy shit, we did it. <laughs> I've seen ugly in my life, but never that ugly. What the fuck are we up against? Those things are everywhere. Never before have I ever seen anything so vicious. What do you think those things are? You know what? I, I don't know. I didn't think to ask. How about you? Do you believe in demons? If you'd asked me that before, I'd have laughed in your face. But now, in the Sumerian myth, they say the souls of the dead went deep underground to the House of Ashes, where they lived on dust plagued by the demons of the underworld. I can't even begin to comprehend that. Like you, I also never believed. But look around you. Look where we are. Look what we have seen. We are trapped in the Sumerian temple. Well, if we're in hell, I guess you should at least know my name. Nick K, Sergeant. Selim Osman, Lieutenant. Iraqi Army. Shukran, Yahuwah. Mailman 2 and Extra to Mailman 3, how copy over? Hey, solid copy, LT. I see your light, keep moving forward. I'm just ahead, over. I'm coming to get you. Your friends better not do anything dumb. Listen, you gotta trust me. They won't hurt you. Down! Down on the fucking floor! Stop pointing your guns at me! All right, everyone, take a fucking second. He's not hostile. I don't want to hurt you. Your uniform tells me something different. Drop your fucking weapon, do it now! No, you lower yours first. Drop your weapon before I fucking drop you! You pull that trigger and I swear to Alibaba and the 40 Thieves is the last fucking thing you'll do! I didn't come this far to die by a trigger. Happy American! Okay! Enough! There's no point in fighting. Not anymore. I ought to put one through your fucking skull. It won't change anything. I'd still be in this hell. Don't tempt me. We're heading back to the temple. Tie him up. If he tries anything, put him down. After all we've been through? Thanks a lot. Hey, you two boys do this together? Of course we did. We fought it together and we won. Jason, we need to talk about this guy. Not now. This plane's a bust. Whatever the hell happened to Joey, he's gone. And there are fuck knows how many of those things out there. I say we pull back to the temple and regroup. I think that's the best plan I heard all day. That's the last one. Should at least slow them down. Long enough to spot them on the cameras.
We should reset that chirp wire. Give me a hand. We've been in some fucked up situations before. Uh -uh. Never as fucked as this. If I gotta fight these things, there's no one else I would want by my side. You know I always got your back, buddy. Come with me. This is something else. You don't think? I well, know how many places like this we've bombed without a second thought. These relics are better off in the dust. What's your problem? These people didn't ask for this war. Why are you defending the enemy, Sergeant? You and me both know they're not all our enemies. Fuck, Jason. It's about the girl at the checkpoint. Shit, Nick. How many times? We thought she had a bomb. It was just a bag of groceries. We fucked up. That girl's death is getting under your skin, buddy. Yes, as a matter of fact, it is. Isn't it getting under yours? We still have the east flank to cover. Eyes open. Let's go. The demons will kill me. You have to untie me. <clears throat> you think I'd leave my man here if I thought there was a threat? That's not how we do things around here. It's okay. Buddy's here to protect you. Don't worry. We got this place locked down tight. <laughs> this here's as safe as it's gonna get. I'd feel a lot safer with a gun in my hand. No way am I giving you a weapon. That don't mean I'm gonna feed you to your demons. And if it moves, we'll be here before a prayer leaves your mouth. We've got work to do. Let's go. Christ, these doors took a hammer in. Those things must have come through here in force. Whoever manned that weapon took a stand and held them off. Before they got massacred from behind. These creatures aren't dumb. The predators. Bet your bottom dollar if they came this way before. They could come again. This have been to hell. Looks like he's been drained dry. He's got to be one of those explorers.
crap. What'd you find? Nothing that's gonna get us out of here. Right now, I couldn't give a crap if it was the crown jewels of England. Looks like a good choke point. Any of those freaks coming up from below are sure to pass through here. Set some charges? Yeah. Yeah, rig these pillars for maximum coverage. More likely to see the trip wires, though. You think those things can tell the difference? We shouldn't underestimate them. We mine the sides. We're more likely to catch them out. Smaller spread, but the explosives are better hidden. What do you think? Let's go for maximum coverage. Wire up the middle of the corridor. Let's do it. We gotta make each one count. I can hear your brain taking away. What is it? Should have given her a second warning. Fuck, man, I wish I hadn't asked. I'm through talking about this. Yeah? What's left to say? You know that checkpoint was a prime target for suicide bombers. We had to act in the moment. We had to make a call. It was the wrong call. Why is it that no one ever tells us straight? Everyone just makes a bullshit to get by. That's why we're in the sandbox in the first place, right? I just want the truth, Jason. Shooting that woman messed with my head. You seriously gonna tell me it didn't mess with yours, man? We fucked up. If we make it out of here, we'll face up to that. If we die down here, maybe it's what we deserve. You know I was seeing Rachel. Are you serious? Been three weeks. It's armed. Found a camera here. Let's head back. Alright you guys, so I think I'm going to conclude this episode here. Sorry I got quiet towards the end of the video. I'm just trying to process everything and we, <sighs> okay, so I want you guys to go in the comments now if you made it this far in the video and let me know what you think. Are you thinking the same thing that I'm thinking? Are these actually demons, or are they something else? Because, first of all, bullets didn't kill it. A truck didn't kill it. The only way we're killing these things is... Stabbing it in the heart. Stabbing them in the heart. And we found a body. And one of the... I think it was Jason that said, This body has been drained. Are these... Vampires? Dude, this game is utterly just intense and captivating all the way through since the very beginning. So I'm very happy to have finally got my hands on it, even early, or than other YouTubers. So, but are you guys? I'm gonna conclude it here. This is your boy Bebop Gaming, and I will catch you guys in the next one. If you like the video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. But otherwise, I'll catch you later. Bye.